Welcome, Geminis. I'm back. Come on in the building. Hit the like button on your way in, guys. Show me some love. Show me some love. Show me some love. Don't forget to comment, guys. Um, if this message resonates with you, don't forget to share with your family and your friends. If you're new, don't forget to click that bell to subscribe, all right? So, Geminis. Hmm. Geminis. <laughs> Oh, before I get into you guys' read, I've got to let you know about my special. Um, so, I got a lot of messages where people were asking me to extend the readings, um, the sale that I had going for last month. I am going to extend the reading for the month of April. So, through the entire month of April, um, I am going to continue with the sale, which the reading will be $44.44. You get a detailed reading you get one question and it's a detailed reading and you get a bonus question okay your bonus question will be answered utilizing the pendulum here um so it would have to be a yes or no question all right that's the only catch to it it has to be a yes or no question for your second question okay you're going to get that for free all right you're going to get that for free oh all right the cards are ready to talk so let's see what's what Okay. Okay. I feel like you guys are trying to evolve, okay, to stability and security and growth. Like, you guys' focus is on evolving, okay, to the next phase. Growth. I got the butterfly and the palm tree, okay? So, this is definitely, like, moving, stepping things up to the next level here. A higher level of commitment okay so that's that's amazing okay some of you guys could be discussing getting married or moving in with each other or something to that nature but it's a higher level of commitment here all right so i got a hand of cards okay take a chance risk being strategic looking at all your options not showing your hand okay so maybe you guys <laughs> Look at this. I got a lot of good cards for you. Happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness. Okay, with somebody here, maybe, are you guys, is somebody chasing you? Or, because we got the chaser. Somebody is codependent in a relationship. Somebody's afraid of being abandoned. Um, I'm seeing that as well, okay? So take a chance. Let's, let's just get into it, okay? So let's look at current, current energy. Okay, because these were just flying out to me. Let's see. Current energy for Gemini's. What's going on? This is a timeless read, guys. So whenever you're meant to see it is when, simply when you're meant to see it. Okay, but this is the month of April, so that's where my focus is. Okay, so Gemini's. Okay. We got karmic relationship. See this? Some, for some of you... There's a marriage here. Okay, for some of you, there is a marriage here. Somebody's in a karmic relationship. Somebody's dealing with the karmic. Why is the what happened in the past? Show me past energy. Ooh. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Libra. Okay, y'all watching somebody. Y'all are like low-key watching somebody. Y'all are low-key watching somebody. Somebody before, they didn't. They don't make healthy decisions. Okay, maybe you were frustrated feeling like you weren't enough. Okay. Maybe they've been out dealing with the karmic. Show me future energy for Gemini. Palm tree, okay, here we go again. Stability, security, growth, endurance, okay. But something here, oh, okay, what is this? Are some of you, I'm getting like, okay, before I say that, let's see. 
outdated thinking, conditioned, replaying events over it in your head. For some of you, this is like a, a marriage that's outdated or the way someone thinks is outdated, the way they view it is outdated, okay? Someone could be out dealing with the karma. Why is karmic relationship here? Okay, oh, somebody's trying to sabotage. Oh, okay, yes. Okay, so someone could, okay. All right, so let me get this straight. Someone's trying to sabotage a relationship here. Now, with karmic relationships, it doesn't necessarily have to be that someone is in a karmic relationship. Somebody is having triggers, okay? Resentment, letting resentment. There's some lessons that need to be learned, or someone is having issues with letting go. Um, and someone here. Presently, there may be like a breakup or a separation or there's a pattern or somebody's feeling abandoned or there's like a silent treatment here, okay? So there could be a little bit of issues here, okay? So maybe that's why Palm Tree came out because your primary focus is to get things back stable because somebody could be giving somebody the cold shoulder. Somebody could be, cut, you know, like giving somebody the silent treatment or maybe someone feels abandoned, okay? Yeah, the passion is has left, okay? The passion is gone. We got the Grim Reaper and we got passion. So the chemistry isn't the same. The chemistry isn't the same, okay? Somebody is sabotaging the relationship and then your focus is on trying to get this back together. Okay, now we got it. Why are sunglasses here? Why are sunglasses here? For past energy. Oh, hell no. <laughs> like, literally all the cards just fell out. Sunglasses. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Okay, we're going to try this again. I want to see why. I feel like you got your eye on somebody. You're watching them. Or somebody. Like, you're trying to figure something out. Okay? Let's see. I need some glasses here. Cupid's arrow. Again, we got cassette, okay, and photograph. You might be reminiscing on things. You're replaying something in your head. Like, you're looking back on how things used to be is what I'm getting, okay? I feel like you're looking back on how things used to be because we got love call. This person may have used to express their love to you and tell you that they're thinking about you and they want to let you know. But then all of a sudden, you might feel like this person is no longer, they, they're not like that anymore right now. Like, they, they aren't there right now. Maybe you were watching to see if some new, someone new was coming in. But I feel like presently, you feel like you're, you're dealing with some triggers right now, okay? Maybe you feel resentment. You're feeling a little bit of turmoil. And it's because somebody is, there's a separation or a silent treatment or abandonment issues. Or if someone's afraid that they're going to be abandoned or there's going to be some type of breakup. But then we got palm tree, okay? So like I said, for future energy, it's about stability, security growth, endurance, flexibility. So let me see why palm tree is here. I'm getting all in. I'm just like going all through this. I ain't even supposed to be doing all of this right now at this second, but this is interesting. Why is palm tree here? Engagement rings. There's a marriage here. For some of you, if you aren't married, 
someone may be proposing, okay? Because I got palm tree, which is the four of wands in the tarot, which is about stability, growth, the marriage card, okay? And then we got engagement ring, okay? Engagement, partnership, commitment, completion, a union. For some of you, there may be a coming, a truth coming out that someone could be married, okay? That someone may be dealing with the snake. Let's get into it. This is juicy. Let me see what is going on right now. Y'all hit the like button because I feel like shit about to get real. Hit the like button, comment below. Shit about to get real. Look at that. Pay the swords at the bottom of the deck, okay? Y'all got y'all eye. Y'all watching some. Y'all watching this person. You think they? I feel like you think this person is sneaky. Give me past, present, and future energy for Gemini's past energy. Well, this one to come out first. Nine of Pentacles. Power. You need future energy. Seven of Cups. Hmm. Somebody's been holding back their ex. You guys may have been holding back how you feel, okay? You may have been holding back. Or someone hasn't been expressed. Like they, I feel like someone's holding back tears or holding back. Holding their emotions back. Not really expressing themselves. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Someone said that they were single. Someone is saying that they was that they're single and they're damn well. Like you guys may have take take you guys may have like went on a split or a break. Because I got the four of swords here and the two of cups and the ten of pentacles. Yeah, like the Ten of Swords, there was some type of ending, okay? But I feel like you guys started back up because I got the Ace of Wands. I feel like there is a break period for some of you. There's a marriage or you've been with this person for a long time. But then there's a separation period. And then I think you guys may have started back up. Okay. I'm getting a lot of, I'm getting a third party here with this Queen of Wands and the Ace of Wands. Definitely somebody's, somebody's, you know, or there has been like, a, this person doesn't show you any um, affection, a passion, okay? They may have stopped having sex with you or you may have stopped having sex with them. And there's been like a period of like a break period, okay? So somebody has been saying that they are single or that they are going to just do things on their own. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Two of Swords and the Three of Swords. And then we go again. See... Y'all, y'all keeping an eye on this person, most definitely. This has came out three times. Y'all keeping an eye on this person. Y'all keeping an eye on this person. But this is like conflicting, okay? This is conflicting you. With the two of swords here, you know that you have a decision that you needed to make. Why is the three of swords here? Like I said, there could be a third party. Yeah, it's like bad news. Okay, like you you prepare. You was prepared for, for it. I feel like you guys were prepared. Like, okay, if they want to split or whatever, I'm ready for it. I'm prepared. So that page of cups is saying that there was, you know, kind of some bad news. Tower, you could be dealing with the Scorpio, but there's just like something out of the blue. Some of you, I'm, 
I really don't want to say this, but there could even be like domestic violence in a situation with this tower and the seven of wands. There could be like an altercation, okay? Why is the seven of wands here? Your intuition is telling you to, to wait. The devil. Here we go again. Page of Swords. It's the fourth time. Your intuition is telling you to wait to this person. Like, this person is the devil. I feel like you're depicting this person as the devil. Could be a Capricorn, or this person is just way out of hand. Way out of pocket. And the reason why I say, like, could be, like, domestic violence, or this person gets real rowdy when you say something to them, is because I got the Tower and the Seven of Wands. This kind of makes me feel like some type of altercation. Like when, like you may piss this person off and then they, why is the devil here? Hmm. This person could have like some type of habit. They can have like a drinking habit. They can be like a, on some type of drugs. Oh, you. Y'all could be stressing the hell out. Eight of Swords and the Nine of Swords, okay? You possibly like aren't sleeping good at night. You get them with an Aquarius. Yep, five of pentacles. You could be feeling alone or rejected. You need some type of assistance with this temperance card and a justice card. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius or a Libra, but I'm getting like contacting, calling the police. Is even what I'm getting. I don't like this. I really don't. Page of Wands, Temperance, and the Justice card. I really don't. I don't really like this, okay? Well, it's the Seven of Cups here. I'm going to keep going because I, I, I just feel like somebody needs to hear this because I know a lot is going to come out of this. Seven of Cups is future energy. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Ace of Cups. You may feel like you need to socialize or get out more, okay? I feel like you may feel like you... Maybe there is like a Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or somebody that's stable you know, very stable financially or stable-minded, I feel like you may feel like you need to socialize, okay? You don't feel like you need to get out. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Nine of Swords, okay. You're confused. You may feel conflicted. Yeah, you want this. Somebody is reckless as fuck. What is this? What the hell is this? Like, I'm getting a big argument here. The Fool, Five of Swords, Nine of Wands. This is someone feeling like they have to put a guard up because somebody is coming towards them. And whoever this is, they're coming fast. Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands, Five of Wands, the world. That's an honest lesson. You know what? I don't even want to read this anymore. Let's go to, um, let's get some advice.
Let's see what message is there for my Geminis, for my Geminis, for my Geminis. Share your voice. Come out of the cave. See, this is why I chose to continue to read because it's really pissing me off. I'm not even going to lie. It's really kind of pissing me off that this type of energy came out, okay? You got to let somebody know what's going on. You got to open up your mouth and express yourself and come out of whatever cave you're in. You're going to have to come out of that, okay? I feel like you got things going on that you're not telling people about. How are you being called to step up and lead? Oh, my God. Look at this. Protection. Call back your power. Cut the cord. I'm gonna just let I'm gonna just let I'm just a channel. I'm just a channel. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let the angels and my spirit guides use me as a channel right now. Cause I'm so pissed. Anna, grandmother of Jesus. Seed in the light, lay a foundations, divine plan. Soul family. I'm getting like, you need to get in contact with your family. You need to reach out to your family. Call in your tribe. You don't have to do it alone. You need to call. You guys need to call in. Call in your family. Call in your tribe. Call in your people who you know are going to assist. What message is there for Gemini? Ooh. We got compromise. You're ready. And look here, there's something better. Listen to your intuition. Some of you guys' health may be out of whack, okay? Improve your health. What message is there for Gemini, please? Some of y'all are just waiting, or you're plotting, or some of you may be trying to plan some type of exit, okay? Because I got a year from now. And I want to keep this to the side. I keep getting there something better. And improving health. Don't stop. Communicate clearly. Okay, communicate clearly. Meditation is going to bring you the answers that you need. Give me one more card. Get more information. Why is compromise here? King of Wands. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But this person is controlling as fuck. Why is your ready here? We got the Five of Cups, King of Pentacles, uh, Virgo Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like some of y'all may feel like you will regret something. Maybe this person provides you with stability um, or they're giving you money. King of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. But they, there's a third person here, okay? Queen of Wands in reverse. There's a third person here that they are not blessed. Yes, there, there's a third party here. I'm telling you that right now. And be careful because for some reason, it may be somebody like that's close. Somebody's feeling stabbed in the back. And we got the Empress and the Ace of Wands. Now, this could be a pregnancy, but this is definitely, I'm feeling like another woman. Or a third party. It could be male or female. Why is the five of cups here? Seven of cups. Regretting a decision. <sighs> I 
I feel like you're staying quiet because you don't want to regret a decision. You don't want to look back at it, back at the situation later and regret it. Why is wait here? Three of Cups. Somebody is starting an argument. Maybe when you get around people or they get around a group of people, somebody's starting an argument. They like to argue. <laughs> Somebody has a drinking habit too. Why is the Three of Cups here? Somebody waits till they get drunk and then they start acting crazy. Stop drinking. Stop partying. Something here about us uh, when there's a, a group of individuals or this person goes to partying or had too much to drink. <laughs> got the death card. Cut that shit out. They got to cut it out. Whoever's doing this, stop it. I sound like somebody's, like I'm you guys' mother right now. Not the right time. And I think it's, it's bothering me more so because it's kind of, I know someone that is actually a Gemini that could be possibly going through this right now and isn't saying nothing. But everybody knows and it's bothering, it's, you know, it's, it's kind of bothering me right now. All right, so we got not the right time. Look at that, Ten of Swords. Look, look at this. Once again, we got the spy card. What are y'all spying on? Wow, what... What are y'all watching? Okay. What is this? Got the justice card and the knight of swords. Stop watching something. Stop watching something. Okay. Maybe like you know you know we are in quarantine so maybe you're watching a lot of just stuff that got to do with justice or crime or something to that nature i'm getting like crime or what's the what's the show called um cops or something like that or just something that has to do with the law i'm just getting that like Maybe this person has some issues with the law. Don't stop. Why is don't stop here? Page of Cups. It's in the reverse. Why is the Page of Cups here? Temperance. Eight of Wands. King of Pentacles. I feel like some of y'all need to do some healing, okay? Um, there needs to be some type of balance here. I feel like there's needs the need to heal, okay? Somebody's health could be in jeopardy, okay? I feel like there needs to be some type of balance. Somebody may need to go see a doctor, a therapist, because um, we got the Page of Cups and the Temperance card. Somebody could, you know, need to talk to a therapist or, you know, someone that they could, you know, express their issues to, okay? And then we got get more information. Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so this is why you guys are spying. Y'all know that this person has some other crazy stuff going on. We got the moon card here. You may be getting some information from somebody, okay? Knight of Pentacles could be a Capricorn or somebody just young, okay? Somebody's coming to tell you. Some of the truth is getting ready to come out. You've been looking for it and you're getting ready to get it. We got the lovers, okay? This is you guys' energy. Uh, Queen of Swords, the Hermit. King of Swords, Three of Swords, okay? Two of Swords. Whatever you've been digging and prying for, it's getting ready to come out. There's some things that you don't know about, okay? Something that's hidden. Why is the moon card here? 
Ace of Wands, I'm telling you. About who somebody's been, somebody could have been most definitely sleeping around, okay? Somebody's waiting on the right moment to tell you, okay? Could be dealing with the cancer. Somebody is waiting on the right moment to ask. Maybe you're waiting on the right moment to ask because every time you say something to this person, they start acting crazy. But you're waiting on the, the right moment to ask, okay? There could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces involved, okay? I want to see why a year from now is here. Why is a year from now here? Ugh. Pay the source again. Lovers, you guys is empty. Why is the page of swords here? I feel like some of you guys are still going to be, you know, just keeping an eye out, okay? Just keeping an eye out, hanging. I feel like. I'm still going to be watching, keeping an eye on, on this person. This is, I was definitely not expecting that. This is a lot. Okay? This is definitely a lot. Y'all got to let me know what's going on, okay? Y'all let me know what's going on. Y'all make sure y'all share this message because there could be someone out here that needs to hear this message, okay? Um, if you are if you are in this situation, I don't give a damn. I don't condone in none of this. None of, of no type of abuse. Emotional, um, verbal, none of that. Because I've been there and done that, okay? And I just don't condone in it. I feel like you can always find better, do better, okay? So, y'all let me know what's going on. If you need to book your own personal reading, reach out to me. Contact me via email. The contact information is in the drop box below, all right? And I love you guys, and I'll talk to y'all later.